The president is switching back into campaign mode while he's here in Florida, and it comes at a time when he has a major new vacancy in his senior staff, and a running feud with his former lawyer is taking a new turn. Escaping Washington winter, the president and his family are back in Florida, though he left plenty of heat at the White House, stoking his public battle with former lawyer, fixer, and convicted felon Michael Cohen. Michael Cohen lied about the pardon. I was a stone cold lie. The president making a new claim on Twitter Friday, referring to Cohen as a fraudster. He directly asked me for a pardon. I said no. Cohen fired back. Just another set of lies. But Cohen has his own credibility conflict, telling Congress... I have never asked for, nor would I accept, a pardon from President Trump. However, Cohen's lawyer says his legal team had made the request. His lawyer said that they went to my lawyers and asked for pardons. But no direct answer on whether he would consider a pardon for his former campaign chairman, Paul Manafort, who was convicted on bank and tax fraud charges. I feel very badly for Paul Manafort. Uh, I think it's been a very, very tough time for him. Sympathy aside, the president made a false claim about what the judge in Manafort's case said. The judge said there was no collusion with Russia. It's had nothing to do with collusion. There was no collusion. But Judge T.S. Ellis had only made clear Manafort was not charged with any Russia election conspiracy. He did not offer an opinion about collusion. In the West Wing, more turnover as the fifth communications director resigned. Bill Shine will take a position with the president's reelection campaign, making a solemn stop in Alabama. The president and first lady toured damage from Sunday's deadly tornado. Well, I saw this. It's hard to believe, actually. And paid their respects to victims and survivors. And while he's here in Florida, the president hosted one fundraiser last night. Another coming up tomorrow. He will speak at that fundraiser. It is for both the Republican National Committee and his own reelection campaign. But because it will be held on the grounds of Mar-a-Lago, his estate, there will be no press coverage, so we won't know exactly what he has to say.